Welcome to Dust Till Dawn. This is the sequel. I would say EDM's like, oh, yeah, oh, this, you. We're out here outside Chandlerville, Illinois, and from dusk till dawn, it's a two-day music festival full of EDM and some bands on Saturday. Well, from dusk till dawn, our homie Dan Winston, who was the originator of the idea, um, wanted to do a festival for people around this area, you know, where we can have two days of music, food, art, you know, people just getting together and really having a good time camping. And that's what it is. It actually started uh, with uh, Bree and Phil Long. Uh, they wanted to throw just a kind of like a party because they go to a lot of these festivals around the U.S. and they really, really meet nice people, good-hearted people, and they wanted to kind of bring that, bring people together just like they do all around the United States now. I would say that influences for From Dust Till Dawn came from Electric Forest and Wakaruza. Um, also, Burning Man. Burning Man is a huge festival that promotes so much creativity, but definitely bigger festivals inspired us to do this. After we went, we loved them so much, we had to bring it to our friends back home. Definitely a good time out here. Everybody should definitely take notice of what we're doing because, you know, there's not a lot of things around here that happen that's like this, you know, so. I would say this is an electric dance music festival. Uh, recently, it was coined uh, EDM, electronic dance music, and everybody's really uh, riding with that term because it kind of just generally groups all of us together into something that you can easily identify with. There's a lot of different genres of EDM. There's house, there's electro. Drum and bass, moon baton, uh, glitch hop, dubstep. Um, there's lots of them. You got your mid-tempo trap music, which I like to call twerk. Death step, death chord, this, add a little swing to your thing and rename it. I would say it has a lot to do with the style of sounds and the speed. The, the speed is a really big factor in what what defines the different subgenres. And it just gets crazy with how many subgenres, but it's cool that people are creating these subgenres because then it gives people something to look for whenever they're looking for music. Really, there's a lot of subgenres out there and everybody's doing their thing, but collectively they like to call it ED. Now. Killinois Productions is a, a close-knit type friends. We're a crew of DJs and producers that collectively share the same interests and goals. We want to bring good electronic music to the local scene. This event, the whole point of this event, is really to showcase all the artists that are really coming up on the scene and that are part of our crew and are really good friends with our crew. My name is Kevin Moore, uh, alias is Spankalicious. I was booked for this event. I am a producer DJ, here to have a good time and here to create a positive energy and, and spread a good vibe. I was sick of driving an hour and a half, two hours to go do this. I'm like, might as well get my homies together. Like, let's figure this out, let's bring it to home. And I think what people really find appealing about our shows in this area uh, is the, the intimacy, you know, it's not a, a commercialized event where, you know, you go and you pay $5 for a bottle of water and everybody's very, very in touch with each other and we all, we're all here to help each other out and make, you know, take, take this area and the scene in this area to the next level every day. This is the second From Dust Till Dawn that we had. The first year was last year. Um, we did it last August. This year, we have done a lot more promoting, a lot more planning. We have um, more acts from all over the country this year. It definitely, what you can expect is, is, is not to expect anything. You know, you're coming in here, you're stepping into the unknown, kind of. You know, you have, you have a weekend where you don't have a cell phone service. You're not contacting anybody in the outside world. You have 48 hours to 72 hours to, to just kind of, you know, you can come here and self-reflect. You can come here and start something new. You can come here and connect. And I mean, it's just, don't expect anything. Expect the unknown and ex expect open-ended possibilities. Hopefully, um, it becomes a large-scale event. We would love 
to keep doing this in the future and just keep this going as long as we can. Everybody knows that first time that they got the chills from, from music, you know, and I think that's something that once you, you experience it once at a festival, you're always going to be looking for that next time, and I think that's what constantly brings people back to support is definitely just the way music makes you feel and the way we, we feel about giving that to people. If you love music, this is for you. Come out here, we all love music. Might as well love it together.